what, what's your story, man? I mean, I'd be down to bring you bring you to Denver if you want. That was random. <laughs> now, I've gone as far as wanting to redo my build, but the problem is I really like having both of those drawers. One side's just completely kitchen, because I like to cook. And then their side's like clothes and miscellaneous gear, because I like doing miscellaneous things. So, the problem is, is I don't want to sacrifice storage, and I want more headroom. So the only way to get that is to go up. Now, I'm a frugal guy, and I like buying things used. I bought this topper used, and I got it for like 700 bucks or something like that, which is not a bad deal for a topper. The problem is, is that the mid-rise camper shells, when I say mid-rise, I mean a six inch rise, not the super tall grandpa topper, just somewhere in the middle, mid-rise, are almost impossible to find used. Right now I'm in the middle of Nebraska. I've got a six and a half, no, six hour drive. of the peanut butter on the steering wheel. Until I get to my destination, um, and then I have an appointment to get my new topper put on at 1 p.m. today. All right, so today we get to relive at 8.30 in the morning twice because we just entered mountain time zone, which is good because I'm running behind and we just get an extra hour. <laughs> uh, what is going on? Gas burning or what? Why? Why you do this? All right, for all you Nebraskians, isn't Casey's like a rite of passage around here? Is that the breakfast pizza? Come on now. I got a pizza. What, what's your story, man? You, you, did you re out here working or what was, uh, what's going on? No, uh, well, my kids are moving from New York back to the spring, so I figured it might, I, I came from Southern California. Okay. And I made it to the spring. You've been so hitching all the way back from. Yeah. I mean, I'd be down to bring you bring you to Denver if you want. Hell yeah. I'm actually going to grab a Subway too if you wanted to get a sandwich or uh, something. He's buying a burger, so. Oh, okay. All right. I'm going to grab a sandwich and then I'll come back out and meet you. Yeah, hey, you can put your stuff in the back if you want. I don't have a whole lot of room, but. Let's meet you. I like Santa Monica. Santa Monica? Yeah, it's a nice river. Yeah, it's pretty. It's like it's all city, man. <laughs> Have a good one. You too. Well, that was random. <laughs> Ew. I always get like sketched out when people ask me for a ride like that. And this dude just like, after talking to him, he just seemed like so good, you know? That I was just like, my, I'm not gonna do it now. When am I ever gonna do it? You know, because like you're always like, ah, yeah, maybe next time when I'm feeling more comfortable. You're just never feeling comfortable. So the only way you're gonna get more comfortable is by, you know, sticking your neck out there. It's a nice dude. Just trying to get his feet back under him. Dude, there's so many people that have been asking me about uh, what my subway order is. Italian BMT Deluxe, pepper jack cheese, lettuce, onion, tomato, no sauce, and the raspberry cheesecake cookie. Oh, yeah, baby. How's it going? Good, how are you? Good. Good. You can see it looks a lot different in here. Took everything down, cut the wires. You can see there's a couple holes where the wires used to come through. Kind of all wound down there now. Good to go. All right, this is the last time you're going to see this topper on there. I was just telling him, sorry for being a pain in the ass with all the stuff on there. Oh, that's it right there. Yeah. Nice. Sick. All right, you guys know better than I do. I just know how big of a pain in the butt it was to assemble it all. I can climb on the roof and take the tube off. Yeah. Is there anything else you want me to try to take off? No, you're good to be honest, man. Thank you. All right. So we're going to go hit the gym, get a shower, get a pump on. It's still so awkward. Freaking 
Really like workouts. Uh-uh. All right, all clean. If you guys want to look this clean, mapmadeit.com. Get yourself a t-shirt or a hat. Please. All right, they said that the topper's on there, so let's go check it out. Moment of truth. Oh my god. So sick. Alright, so I got everything mounted back onto the roof. Um, it's pretty secure from what I can tell. It's not going anywhere. Let me just explain why this topper is so cool. So it has wind doors on the side, unlike my other one, which means that I can do this. These are on prop lights, so they automatically come on when this opens, or I can turn them on to be on all the time. Let's put them on the prop switch. Uh, these obviously lock, and there's also, on the inside here, you can see, this is called a screen wind door. So you can move that glass on the inside. Super nice, because you can ventilate it. But also, I can come in here and I can reach and grab anything out of the bed. If I like, need to move my pillows or make my bed, you know, before I had to like crawl in through the back. You can see that everything has T-locks on it, so that just makes everything more secure and less likely to rattle open. I mean, if you think about it, there's two secure points where it's locking here rather than just one in the center. You know, this side is the same deal. Locking wind doors, screen side. Now, open this up. You can see how much more room is in this one. With me sitting up. Works nice. We've got a slider back here. And yeah, all right. It's getting late. I gotta go find a couple connectors for my my wires I had to splice open. And then I don't have a very like next level crimper, so what I've always done is used vice grips. on my big battery pack charger onto here because I didn't add it on here before. Hi there, how you doing? Maverick. Maverick. Maverick? Like top, like top gun, yeah. <laughs> they asked a a waiter at a restaurant, what they'd named their kid. Uh -huh. And he said Maverick, uh -huh. but spelled without an E or a C in it. And so I was a no-name baby for like a week. And then they remembered that story. And so here I am today. Oh my God. Curry sauce, fish. You like, you never know? You are? I haven't been to Indiana much, so it's gonna be it's gonna be a big one. But I'm uh I'm excited. Hey, really appreciate it. Thank you. I don't know, man. I like cooking, obviously, but maybe not so much right now. Maybe not so obviously. My refrigerator hasn't been plugged in for a while, so it's probably good. I haven't bought any food. Anyway, we got one more errand to run and then we're gonna find a spot to camp in the truck chopper for the first night. So you might be asking yourself, why are you on the ground in the middle of an REI parking lot, Mav? I bought a cable in REI 
you can see hey, oh way up there the cable's leaking out but it's really hard to grab oh i got it i got it imagine i do all that work and it's the wrong end okay that's enough excitement for the night Let's get out of here. Let's go find a spot to camp. Oh my gosh, ow. Turn our locks. Okay. I am tired. It's so nice being able to sit up, dude. This is so nice. I can't crazy straighten on my back, but it's so much better. All right, well, we're in a quiet little neighborhood. Don't think we'll have any issues tonight, but... It is really weird being able to see through all of this, though. I mean, it's pretty cool. But also a little spooky. Anyway, super hyped in the new topper. I'm gonna hit the hay. Good night. Good night. All right, folks, well, pretty successful first night in the truck. Really loving this new headroom. Very excited about the windows. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Until next time, let's keep on trucking.